Hi, Mom. Yeah. No, can you pick up Chris after school? Yeah, I'm, I'm at the doctor's. Mrs. Harris? Describe your symptoms. H hang on. Stress, headaches, nausea. Yeah, well, I work on Saturdays. And how long has this been? Equanimity. Balance your lifestyle. Hey, Valder, how are you? Well, hi, I'm well. Who do I have in the studios with me? This is John Jacobs. Well, John Jacobs, thanks so much for joining us today. And I was told you could tell us about something that's really important and dear to your heart. Well, um, that would be the Heroes of Optimism uh, search for uh, heroes across this country. We're going to find one in every state, at the very least, um, would you like me to give a little background to where this came would, from? I would like to hear that. <laughs> well, uh, my brother and I, right out of college, started a company. Um, uh, I, I could barely call it a company back then, but basically we were looking for a way to combine art and business. And we, just started, we, we, we started selling, uh, designing and selling t-shirts and selling them in college dorms up and down the East Coast. So we, we bought a used van. We used to sleep in the van uh, every night. We basically lived on peanut butter and jellies, and we were wildly unsuccessful for five years trying to find something that connected with people. And finally, back in uh, 1994, we were down to $78 in the bank and thought we might have to give up this dream of the ultimate road trip that would go on forever. And uh, we had one good idea, and that was to create something that would help people focus on the good in a world that had become pretty complex with a lot of negative information. And that led to our first Life is Good shirt. And we sold that in the street at a street fair, and it sold through like never, like nothing we had ever seen. And so the business sort of took off from there. We stumbled along, learning what we could. But unexpectedly, we started getting letters from people facing great adversity. They would say, you know, my, my Life is Good hat helped me through chemotherapy, it helped me stay positive. Um, and, and all sorts of personal, compelling stories. And we didn't know what to do with them. And we finally realized we just needed to share those stories. So last year, we published a book called Life is Good, the book. And it's based very much on the most compelling stories we've ever received over 20 plus years and the response has been incredible to these stories and we start we decided to bring some of them to life in video form share a lot more of them on our website and the momentum has been incredible and we just want to create a very easy way for people to share stories about heroes of optimism meaning people everyday people that help others to focus on the good and all of us have them in our lives uh, for my brother and I that was our mom um, she was an incredibly resilient optimist in a chaotic little house with six kids every night at the dinner table she'd look around at all of us and say tell me something good that happened today and as simple as those words are they helped us focus on the good and build upon that and it changed the energy in our house and uh, as grown-ups you know, this company has grown a bit and we've listened to our customers, we realize that's a really central part to finding happiness and fulfillment is that choice you can make every day, no matter what's going on in your life, to choose to focus on what's wrong in your life and the world or to focus on what's right and to build on that. And we want to help more and more people do that. And uh, the best way we've found is to share stories like this. And so we're asking people to go to lifeisgood.com backslash heroes and simply tell us about something they know that it inspires them to focus on the good. And okay, you, you wrote the book, 
you, do you have an online, uh, it says also, too, you have an online campaign that supports child care for the disadvantaged? That's right. We have a Life is Good Kids Foundation, and we're actually a for-profit business and a nonprofit. And the Kids Foundation helps kids overcome poverty, violence, and illness. And every time that somebody goes on and shares something about a hero they know, we'll donate another dollar to our Kids Foundation. So it's a big win-win that we, we share these stories that lift people. And when I say we, any community member that chooses to go on to lifeisgood.com backslash heroes and share a story, that story is likely going to lift somebody else that hears it. That's the pattern we've seen. And while they do that, they'll be donating another dollar to help kids in need.